My God is God, and there is no other. My God is the God of Abraham, the God of Isaac, the God of Jacob, and the God of Moses. And my God is holy, righteous, and true. And my God's word will stand forever. My God, awesome in power, spoke the universe into existence. My God stands alone, without equal, without peer. For my God is the Alpha and the Omega, from everlasting to everlasting, without beginning and without end. And my God's word will stand forever. Lord, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 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 And I pray these be your words, Lord, not my words. I pray in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. I am just the dust of the earth, and no one is beneath me. The only thing special about me is that I am forgiven, and I am God's dirt. I had a dream a couple of nights ago, and I wanted to make a video yesterday, but it rained all day yesterday. So I put it off until today, but then last night I had a new dream. At least I think it was a dream. And it was so important that I thought I needed to make a video about the dream I had last night first. And, and I'm, not, I'm not even sure if it was a dream, but, but something happened, and, I, and I'll describe it to you. I was in bed trying to get to sleep, and it was about 3.30, 4 o'clock in the morning. And for some reason, I just couldn't sleep. I was laying in bed, had my eyes closed. I was trying to get to sleep. And all of a sudden, with my eyes closed now, I saw a, I saw a door and it was open and there was light coming through the door and uh, all of a sudden the door just slammed shut I mean just real quick just it just slammed shut and then the light went out and for a moment I thought well maybe it was a, a car across the street sometimes their headlights come into our bedroom and I opened my eyes and I looked around, but I, I didn't hear a vehicle, didn't see anything. It was dark. And then I, I realized that this was a dream or a vision or something. It was, it was from God. That it was a warning that our door to salvation is about to close. Any day, any second. Jesus comes back, raptures the faithful out of here. And we, which are faithful and true to Jesus Christ, we will we will be raptured. We will we will be saved from the horror of the tribulation, and we will be with our Jesus, our great Lord and Savior, in the clouds forevermore. And that's scriptural. I uh, want to read from you. Read for you. Uh, Acts 2 and 17. Okay. And it shall come to pass in the last day, saith God, I will pour up my spirit upon all flesh, and your sons and your daughters shall prophesy, and your old men, I'm sorry, and your young men shall see visions, and your old men shall dream dreams. We are in the last days. And now, more than ever, more people are having dreams and visions than ever before. And now we need to get right with God. More so than ever. We need to carry our Bible with us wherever we go. We need to say the blessing over every single meal we eat. And Bobby and I pray for all of you. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen.